me try the gumbo. My expert chef, Ron DePratt, is revisiting Spirits on Bourbon in New Orleans, Louisiana. I want to test whether the gumbo is still being cooked properly. Last time, he literally threw up from it. Let's see what happens. OK, guys, this is the moment of truth. Cross your fingers. I approve. You did an excellent job since the last time I was here. Everything just cooked to perfection. The gumbo is great. And in Louisiana, that's critical. I applaud you for that. Well, thanks a lot, man. We've been working hard to keep up to your standards. We did it. Now, let's check the temperature. That's ice cold. Wow. Perfect, 178 degrees. Everything is clean. The gumbo recipe is perfect. Consistent. I mean, the fryer is clean, perfect. Everything is date label. That did an excellent job. Ron loving the gumbo two years after he left and still saying it tastes the same meant a lot to us. Just proof that consistency and doing the same thing and the recipe's right, it's important. Brad making magic. Tell me what you think about that. Excellent. Fantastic. That's what I was hoping to hear. Tastes exact same way two years ago. My compliment, man. You're doing an outstanding job. John Tata will be very proud of what you're doing. Consistency. That's what you were always pushing, consistency. Our sales last year were up over a million dollars, and it's still growing to this point. Since the show, we've already went through over 100,000 skeleton cups. We were buying so many cups, we had to buy a warehouse to store all these cups in. Right here, the order that just came in, that'll last us maybe three months. Over here, we have our graveyard of barber chairs. So many people come in a bar and get shots in the shot chair, we just go through them. The shot chair revenue has been unbelievable. Every night, we're going through five or six bottles of liquor just out of the shot chair alone. I knew this chair would be a hit. It's a money maker, and it's great to see the money coming in. We had to let Sick go, so he's no longer with us. You gotta be kidding me. Sick was the only one with any sense in this place. 